Hey everyone, today we are going to see about case record producers. NGM offers a service to its Calico streaming service consumers to request a swap for their streaming devices. If they are broken or need an upgrade, this device swap request must be tracked as a cases and can be initiated by a consumer through the service catalog. For this, we are going to create a record producers. Let's get into the video. Now, service term is instance. We are going to uh, record producer, existing record producer we have. So now uh, we are, before we produce proceed, we should need to create a record producer first. So we, we can open the rec existing rec record producer. So we need, need help with product. This is uh, existing one which is a uh, OB. So this is a uh, OOB uh, record producer which we have. Other thing is um, uh, create case for install base and create case for product is a, a OOB uh, record producer which is available in customer service portal. So before we uh, proceed, uh, we should need to change the application uh, sco scoped application. So here we can change to device swap, device swap management. So once it once we changed, we can refresh this one as well. And you can copy this one. So now you can overwrite this name. I'll request your device back. And you can change the table as well. So this is a device uh, table. So I just selected. Now, what it contain, you can change the short description and description as well. Replace a device for better user experience. Description I can provide for, uh, for the description. You can put this uh, select affected in, uh, install device and desired device model that we uh, replace it. So, like that, I can change. You can go to the accessibility so you can verify a uh, catalog uh, as a custom a consumer service and a category as a support so that uh, your record producer can be included in multiple service catalogs. So, now we can save it. So now we are going to configure a case record producer variables. So let's do that. You can click this variable set and you can click this edit button. Before going into this, I just uh, yeah, we need to remove this HTML description yeah we can remove it and we can save this so this kind of variables we have uh, as we have co copied earlier so I can select asset product contextual script contextual search results description so we can Go to this right corner and you can delete this one. So this uh, in the variable related list, select this select, uh, subject. It will be reused to track the reason for the device swap. So you can open it. So now you can change the subject to reason. You can change the tool tip as well. Please enter reason or your request. So you can update it now. So the variable must be created to track a installed device that must be swapped. 
it will be ref reference field that uh, should need to create so now we can create the new one can map to field and I can make it mandatory here the type should be reference field so the field could be installed device so this one can choose this and in the question install device so you can change the name as well installed like this you can change it so and also the order should be at last so i can make it 400 you can select this type specification and here you can put the table name and underscore install yes underscore item so install base item you can select and uh, save this so now, now we are going to create a new variable you can make it as a reference again the order could be 500 so you can provide the field name the type specification could be product model so you can save this uh, so you can pay make it man mandatory uh, Okay. So now we are going to create a catalog service relationship. So I go to the service definition now. Here I can, uh, this is for uh, uh, created one request a device type a device path let's open it so we have this a uh, request uh, device swap uh, record which which is already created so now we in the related list you can see catalog service relationship you can create a new one so here you can select this uh, request a device swap uh, catalog item And submit this one so now we are going to do the lab verification so before that I just do the uh, impersonation of uh, Sam Collins So once we impersonate, I can go to the uh, service portal. So this uh, it's re uh, automatically relating to service portal. You can go to the request something. Here you can select support. Once you can selected our device, requested dev device swap record producer has been created now. You can click this one. before that i just uh, go back to this one and uh, i can here uh, the in the support option you can click this install base so in the install base list you can notice this calico box v71 you can select this one
so you you can able to see the services and the product on this instance right so you can click this request your device swap in here so this is the listing of this request your device swap record producer in the services is due to this configuration of uh, catalog service relationship applied earlier right we have applied the relationship right due to this only it's it we can able to see it in here okay so uh, now i can provide our information in here and select this calico box then model i can select anything calico box 2.4 so the reason i can provide okay so now we i can submit this one so the portal forward sam callings to the case details page so we can able to see this one right so that's it the lab instance is getting uh populating those kind of uh tickets so then uh, cases has been created so that's it today's video thank you for watching my video